In the previous video, 5 days ago, I promised you that Bitcoin will go lower and crash from this rising wedge pattern and because my crypto paradise always keep its promises, we are down right now by 7%. In this video, we will be discussing the probabilities of continuation of this dump or is this actually the time that you should be buying and we are gonna have the reversal. We will be discussing the price action of Bitcoin in this video, so make sure you are watching. Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Amo from Market of Paradise. So firstly, I want to go through the lower time frame price section, then I want to share with you our medium time frame chart on Bitcoin and we will also have a look at our higher time frame perspective on the price section of Bitcoin. So let me start with the 4 hour time frame which is lower time frame for us. In the previous video I have been discussing the decreasing volume, that is why we have been dumping quite aggressively on this candle from this rising wedge pattern as we have neared the apex of this rising wedge pattern so the volume really break out on this candle right here as you can see and now we are again in a decreasing momentum so we can expect some bigger volatility movement very soon however also the hidden divergence played out perfectly as you know I've been sharing that with you right here at this level also the resistance played out perfectly so if you have been watching the previous video I believe you are making some money or at least you are safe. With Paradise Assembly VIPs we are of course positioned in a short trade right now and we will be looking to take some profits. However, is this actually clever zone to take profits? Let's discuss the new hidden divergence which is forming on RSI indicator right now. So as you can see the oscillator is making higher high, however the price of Bitcoin again is making lower high. So this is again a clear divergence on Bitcoin and this is not very good sign for a current reversal from the current levels right here. What is good sign however is that the sentiment is decreasing with the price. As you remember in the previous video I have been sharing with you the sentiment and I told you guys we are extremely bullish right here. Excuse me we have been bearish however most of the retail been bullish. I have been telling you about the crypto twitter sentiment and just how the market makers have been able to really manipulate the sentiment around retail exactly at this resistance you know that here at this resistance I have been telling you exactly this right now the sentiment is dropping with the price which is telling us that the correction is driven by the panic selling volume from the retail who have been buying Bitcoin right here so that is a very good sign right however for the reversal I still believe we can go a little bit lower probably to the levels we have seen a few weeks ago right here so we can go to to around 0.2 that would be absolutely perfect but the current situation is telling us that the Bitcoin is not gonna go much lower right because with the price the sentiment is also decreasing this is a very good sign however the price action is going to be a little bit more tricky because if you take a look with me right here at the liquidation heat map you can see that there is loads of newly opened short positions and we can have a week out towards $64,000 before going a little little bit lower. So the price action can look something like this because we are right now at this support zone which is being created not just by the past price action as you can see right here this level have been working as a nice support before we have been jumping from that two times and in March also we have been respecting this level right here but it is also our Fibonacci retracement zone so we can expect to have some kind of reaction from this zone right here right so we can actually use this liquidity to go a little bit higher just liquidate here at $64,000 the short positions and then continue lower and why do I think that there is still a risk to wick out a bit lower it is mostly because if I take a look at our medium time frame chart we still have not properly touched this major medium time frame zone right we have wicked it few times as you can see right here however we have not been deeply going for the liquidity right here and that 
that is absolutely essential for us to really go deep here that then we can have some kind of powerful reversal and you already know that once we start hitting this descending trend line for a fourth time this is going to be the time that we will break through it all right as you know from our past videos and also in our free telegram channels i've been with the paradise team updating you about the zigzag reaccumulation always on a fourth touch it's going to break out and now it's not going to be different and we are coming for $93,000 medium time frame resistance if i switch to even higher time frame right now we are on a weekly you know that we are in a creation of a d wave right so the impulsive movements based on the elliott wave theory are moving in a five waves right so we had a b c this is the third wave and now we are in a creation of a d wave then we will have the most volatile one that's going to be the e wave right which will take us towards $93,000 which is right here then we will have some kind of ABC correction we will retest this previous resistance into a powerful support and then you understand that our higher time frame target is $240,000 but before we complete this D wave pattern we really should retest properly this Fibonacci retracement zone which is around $58,000 and that perfectly confluence with our major medium time frame zone all right so i do expect we wick out properly into this medium time frame zone probably even towards $54,000 which is absolutely needed that we get this liquidity right here so we can do a powerful reverse and get this fourth touch and breach it successfully yes it is really dangerous to open a short position new short position right here that is why we have been opening short position right here because with paradise family vips we always enter into trades where the risks to revert probability is the best right so right here we have been right at the resistance the invalidation level for us was extremely close from our entry point and our targets we have been able to put very far away right and these kind of trades if you take only trades like this will make you long-term profitable but suddenly what i see most of the traders to do is to put their stop loss extremely far away from their entry price and their sell targets very close all right and that is perfect for short-term profiting but then you just hit some kind of losing streak right five loses in a row and you can pack up your bags and back to your nine to five job right and this is because we are professional traders is something we want to avoid at all costs that is why we need to have a great risk management enter only the best probability trades etc so right Right now short position new pos short position right here at these levels is not favorable also because our rising wedge target is already hit as you can see right here this is exactly the sell target of the rising wedge pattern if you are reading our blog on mycryptoparadise.com website let me see right here you can see clearly how to calculate the target you basically take the percentage tool from the higher low to the higher high and then you put it to the breakout point and that's how you calculate your target so we are here at the target we are also at support zone right here so opening a short position here is not favorable also because you would need to place your stop loss right here to be safe from any wick outs and then the targets are just a little bit lower we will be targeting this level at fifty nine fifty eight thousand dollars and then we will also have some kind of lucky shot lower targets for the wick out lower as i have shared with you before so the price section right now can look something like this we will liquidate these short positions then we will continue lower however definitely once we are at these levels at around fifty five thousand dollars to fifty eight thousand dollars loads of people will be calling for a pool trend to be finished and that is where with paradise similar vips we will be absolutely buying full-time aggressive mode bitcoin why because if i take a look also at our trading client inside the data what's going on in binance spot exchange you can actually see that the big guys are accumulating bitcoin right so with every dip you can see that the bit versus us spread is increasing on a bit side so you can see this is a high bidding momentum that means loads of buy limit orders have been right here as you can see it is increasing as we go lower and lower and this is extremely great sign that somebody 
Fake is accumulating Bitcoin on every dips, right? This is a clear divergence, which in the past worked very well. As you can see here in this dip, there was this bidding momentum and it increased with a lower low, it increased, it made a higher high, the bid spread. And then we started this bullish momentum, bullish price action right here. At the same time, the asks are decreasing with every top the big guys are distributing less and less coins all right so this is very bullish because the bearish momentum is getting weaker and weaker and the bullish accumulation is getting stronger and stronger ladies and gentlemen i will be updating you about the upcoming price action again in the next videos if you want to get more updates from us definitely visit mycryptoparadise.com join the free channels or if you are ready to start trading like a professional i will welcome you in paradise and vip right after watching this video all right this is all i'm simon and i will see you next time and also smash the like button if you have enjoyed this video and made some money with us cheers